Hi everyone, this is Jenny Street with Confessions of a Hairstylist, and I have my girl Lola here with me. She's with WhatLolaLikes.com. I'm gonna go ahead and put her link below because she is awesome and you definitely have to check her out. So we wanted to do something really fun. So I'm gonna do like a really kind of bohemian, messy Lo Xing Yang with a nice Dutch braid going into it. So it's a really classic do, very simple, and you can do it in a matter of minutes. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so to start this look off, I went ahead and created a deep side part. And what I usually like to do is go from the side part down to the crown, and then I'm gonna go ahead and split the hair in half. Now, when I create updos, I like to work it in sections. So what I'm gonna do is actually, actually section the front pieces out for later, and then I'm gonna work the back section first, and then incorporate our side sections into our nice braid. So now I'm gonna go ahead and turn her around, and we're gonna work this bottom section. So what I like to do is I'm gonna create a nice foundation, a nice base to our style. So I'm just gonna do a simple ponytail. I'm gonna brush the hair a little bit, just to take care of any little bit of flyaways. She has extensions, so I'm gonna be really um, soft when I'm brushing it out. So now we're gonna create our low pony. Secure it with an elastic. Now that I've secured the ponytail with an elastic, I want to create a little bit more of a, a volume, erratic texture on top. So I'm going to hold the base of the ponytail and pinch and pull. That's going to create a little bit of volume and kind of give it more of that disheveled boho feel that we're going for. Now after doing that, we're just gonna create a simple three-stranded braid here and the rest of the hair inside the ponytail. We're gonna do that by splitting the hair in three. I'm gonna add a little bit of texture spray in there by Kenra. This is dry texture. And then I'm gonna simply just pancake the braid out for a little fullness. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take the braid and just simply wrap it around our elastic band and create a really nice low braided chignon. Securing it as I go with some bobby pins. All right, so now I'm gonna start incorporating the side sections into our style. So I wanna only create our braid on our left side. So to incorporate the right side section, I just wanna create a nice, fun twist in the hairstyle to kind of create that both ho feeling. So all I'm gonna do is twist the hair, add a little bit of our dry texture spray by Kenra, and then I'm gonna simply pinch and pull. I've been utilizing this technique a lot in my updos. So now I'm just gonna drape that section across. Take our bobby pin and simply bobby pin it into place. All right, so now we're gonna create our Dutch braid on the left side. I like to do this by taking a small triangle section in the front here, splitting that in three, and then you wanna do a Dutch braid by working underhanded. So I take the right section over, under into the middle, left section, under into the middle. Now that middle section's over to our right, so we wanna start incorporating hair, adding a bit of hair from the parting to the braid, and now that whole section's going into the middle. I'm just gonna repeat this uh, technique until I run out of hair. Once I get to the ends, I'm just gonna go ahead and secure it with an elastic. Now I'm gonna stretch the braid out, also known as pancaking it, by simply pulling the braid a little bit. This is gonna really help her hair appear to be a lot thicker than it actually is. So 
So now that I pancaked the braid out, I'm just gonna go ahead and drape it across the back of her hair and bobby pin it to secure it into place. And tucking the ends underneath. All right, so I'm just gonna finish this look off by spraying a little bit of hairspray by Kinra, pulling on it just a little bit for a little bit more volume. And you can see that we created a gorgeous bohemian style up style in just a few minutes. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to check me out on Instagram at the Confessions of Hairstyles, as well as Lola. And I'm gonna go ahead and put her link below and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon.